If you're not already excited, get excited, gosh darn it, because now is the time to get excited, because we're up to right now number 55, Taste Along, with Adam the Wine Guy. That's me. Check it out, adamthewineguy.com. That's the place to go. Spend a bunch of time. There's videos, articles, all kinds of stuff to see. And while you're at it, have a little window popped up so you can taste along right now the freest rosé, the 2007 Napa Valley, straight out of California, Napa, up north. It's a beautiful drive, beautiful place to visit, and the Frias family always big, wide open arms. They'll greet you with a hug. Look at that. Look, just like a hug. Look at the embrace I'm giving you. Look at the embrace I give you, people. Look at this. It is me. It is you. We are sharing this wine. This time we share together is so special to me. Let's get into the Frias family 2007 Napa Valley Rosé. Right about now would be the time to do it, folks. We got it in our glass. It's a beautiful color somewhere between like coral and salmon, really nice and vibrant. And as I'm just even sitting here looking at the color, the nose is just jumping out of the glass. I'm getting a lot of these like rose hips, a lot of these herbaceous qualities, big time herbs. Mm, beautiful, almost like herbs in Provence, if you will. And if you won't, I will. And as we swirl this in the glass, we take one more whiff to reveal some notes of tropicality, hints just hints of citrus notes. And if you wonder what's going on here, gee, the taste of in. That's right. It's sort of that traditional sommelier tool that I love to wear just to throw you off a little bit because, as you know, I'm not your grandma sommelier. Let's get this in our mouth. Let's get it rocking around because, ladies and gentlemen, it is time for today's monkey time. Let's do it. Rock that shit. Mmm. like candy. Beautiful. It even has these like notes of like Fruit Loops to me right now and I'm getting these like springtime raspberries and strawberries, hints of blueberries, this underlying dusty quality that's really interesting. With some shellfish this would be outstanding. Really, really a rockin' wine. Also, this paired up with a soft pair of lips, I can't think of a better thing. Thanks a lot for stopping by today to uh, taste along with Adam the Wine Guy today. We're up to number 55. Tune back in tomorrow. we got another one coming your way. As always, check out AdamTheWineGuy.com. Check out the blog. Always something new. The Rosé from Frias 2007, straight out of Napa.